everyone! So I actually have some pretty exciting news. Tomorrow I'm taking Frankie to an invitation-only show, Bear Creek Invitational. They're hosting their annual dressage show at the Yorvik Stables as part of their open house event and we're lucky enough to be invited. The show consists of two tests, Introductory Test A and Introductory Test B. So what we're doing today is preparing him for the show that's happening tomorrow. He hasn't been off property to a show in a while, so it will be a good experience to get him back into the swing of showing. hot this summer in Jorvik and Frankie loves the turnout, but because of his dark coat he gets sweaty really fast. The sweat crusts up and makes his coat kind of stick together and he looks like a wet dog which makes you laugh every time. I think he knows how silly he looks though because he looks at me like, mom, please help me, I look so dumb. Normally after I groom him, I go and take him to the wash stall to bathe him, but I want to try on his show tack to make sure that it all fits before I pack it into the trailer. Once we showed up to a show without the correct size girth and my saddle nearly slid off, but thank goodness this horse is so patient, he saved my butt so many times. Since Frankie does get really sweaty, I can normally curry out his sweat clumps, but I still need to wash them out, especially for the show. Frankie isn't the happiest when it comes to baths, he is especially sensitive around his stomach area when it comes to the water. I think it just tickles him and he does not like it. I've tried working with him on it, but I think it's just something he'll never enjoy. I sprayed Frankie down with Shoshin, so hopefully when he rolls in his stall, he won't get dirty again. While he's drying off, I'm gonna go pack the trailer with the hay bags and his tack. I have my show clothes in the back of the truck already, so I'll see you guys in the morning. It's currently 6 a.m. and I have to get to the barn and load Frankie into the trailer so we can drive to the stables. It's about an hour drive and our ride time isn't until 11 a.m., but I'd rather be there early and have enough time to show Frankie the venue than be late. He's in a stall in the barn ready to go. I just need to put his shipping boots on and load him up. He's very easy to trailer and load, so I'm hoping that it will be a breeze. The open house is as busy as it always is this time of year. It's a really good thing that we arrived early since the atmosphere is very energetic and I can already feel Frankie getting excited. The first test we have to do is introductory test A, which is only walking and trotting. I'm not too worried about this test since Frankie is easy to handle at those two gates. I'm going to lunge him to get some of his energy out before it's our turn to go. There are a lot of talented riders here and I'd be lying if I said I wasn't nervous.
We just got called into the waiting area for our turn. Frankie does seem a bit up, but I think lunging was a great idea because I can't imagine the amount of horse I would have if he had a lot more energy right now. My friend M will be recording our round, so hopefully it goes well. I'm really happy with how that test went. I did have to give Frankie a couple half halts to keep him in check. I could feel him wanting to speed up a bit. But we have about two hours until our second test and unfortunately the lunch areas have been closed off for the rest of the day. I just hope that Frankie stays calm and doesn't explode when we get back into the arena. just got the notice that it's almost our turn to go. I really hope that Frankie will be easy to control. I can just feel his energy building up standing here. My main goal now is just to not fall off and get through the entire test without being excused. definitely could have gone better. We made it through the entire test without being excused and that was my goal so I am happy with that. I'm going to go ahead and cool this guy down then get him back in the trailer and take him home to Starshine. Frankie is back in his turnout pen and is definitely tired out after a long day at the showgrounds. Even though we didn't do as well as I hoped, I'm still proud of him for trying his best. We actually ended up placing fourth overall. It has been a very long day and I'm ready to hit the hay. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you all next time. Bye everybody.